Everybody's sad. And this is Hunter Gorman Collab, and I'm gonna answer questions. How old are you? Why are you on this planet, Simba? I'm, I'm not the same age as everybody, because you guys are really crazy on hypnosis. You're like, to know together is knowing. And that's fun for your game. But, like, not everybody is not interested ever in real life, but that's just that if you're by yourself in your fucking crazy situation. So, what was the question? How old are you? Why are you on this planet? What did I just hear? What's going on? Oh, uh, how old are you? Why are you on this planet? I don't know. I said that if I was different, and then I said, but that every day, I'm 400, but that's different, because I'm a ghost. But why I'm on this planet? Because it's, um, I don't know. I got different. What planet did you think you're on? That them on the same one? But, like, it is your work pretty far. What if you thought that you are the same asshole, and you're in North Korea again? But I'm saying, but I don't know. My mom's pretty young. Um, but though. Uh, yeah, I don't know about every day. Where do you come from? Um, I come... I think I come from a planet... Um, I've since learned my home planet is called Universal Realm. And it said that what is going on of it, that that would make me a Sun Universal Realm. But if say, that I don't have to know what you think, a doctor of mercy on this, except that that's a, a fucking trick from the planet that I'm from, which is called Universal Run. So that's the weird that you never run. And what you said is crazy of it, because I don't know what you think you can know about the planet, but like there's kids that look to be of alien, but you can explore my website and see the photographs I have of me. One of them it says aliens that are kids, um, or kids that are aliens or something. Um, and it's got a, a picture of it that where my eyes are looking really trippy in the picture. But there's other chicks and girls and them and uh, some boys of that know how to do crazy cool things. But we look like we're something on the same planet. But there's keep there's infinity to a human pattern and expression and similarities you could have with someone. So it's pretty good. But I'm from Universal Run. Do you really believe in robots getting simple? Yes, I do believe in robots. But that's because I know about them. Um, let's say, if you guys want to know about a robot, I don't know what you think everybody is. If I said that we're a strong location of our core, I'll call in, I don't know, I should have a cookie on the heart, like I'm eating, I'm like, you know, they're okay, and where is she, and I'm But I'm eating, and this is, you know, they're cooking, and I'll go, okay, and I'm not, I am. But I'm not like, you know, I go, eh. We don't have a, um, discourse across the planet right now for, uh, what is a living creature? What is human? It is really crazy. But that's why we're in World War Three right now. So like definitely there's robots. Um, I know some robots. Jeremy Sumter's a robot. If you want to talk to him, that's the actor who played Peter Pan in the two thousand three movie. But that's right. He's an android. But that means he's living flesh. Right. So like if them said, but like, you know that the Fate Line God, the Legends of like in Star Ocean, the, um, till the end of time, I think the PlayStation Two game. That's Fate Line God. is R two D two. But that's a mega legend. But we're destroying. Everybody who's evil now, so you guys can get the real stories of everything. But yeah, robots are real. M but yeah. What is the secret to the kingdom of Native America? What the, uh, What is the secret to the kingdom of Native, Native America? But I can tell that I know that question came from Jeffrey Bowers. Who, I need to know that he understands the secret of the kingdom of Native America is your father, Jeffrey Bowers. The strength of the channel of planet and who they believe and where they come to know about understanding is how do you get adults and even idiots, stupid heads, to believe in the love of power for the planet of a dinosaur king that's a Charmander. But see, the stress in the situation is there's so many children in these secret worlds of it, but that what is the secret? It is anarchy and of love, but there's a few stressful people in a situation where you gotta figure out what's going on of it. Cause little baby Chumper, the dinosaur king of love, is a lot older than everybody you know about. He's a lot older. But that's that. So like, what you see as elder is really ridiculous. 
you can't be a socialist standing when you say elder. You can't check with people for what an elder is. But you're going to go ahead and forget yourself and what socialism is. So when you forget yourself, you're not going to be in anyone's kingdom, but you're going to be trespassing in where you say you think you are. But of them, probably the awakening of our planet love of life to know about everybody who's a dragon, like Lindes, and of Sad, and of Spiral the Dragon, and um, Tommy Knight. If you don't know about Tommy Knight, he's on the show there's, there's like a uh, on like I was running by Doctor Who the show, but there's called the Sarah Jane Adventures or something, and he's the the boy on that show is super fine. But that's a dragon. His name is Dragonite. He's really good. Where is continental Hawaii supposed to go? The planet's already covered, King Simba. That's cr crazy table game you started at. What well, do you mean the planet's already covered? What? Where did you get your fucking education? Did you know mine's better and I'm more intelligent so it has to be? What the fuck are you talking about? Where's H continental Hawaii gonna go? Well, it's a world war. First of all, I don't know where you heard continent of Hawaii. So there's lots of places that get destroyed. Um, before... Shit, what war is it? Um, east of Siberia used to be Soviet, which is monster hell. Monster hell. And so the, what you call the islands of Nippon, nobody from Japan, and if you don't, you want to say that's Japan now, that's never been Japan. It, nobody from Japan lived there. It was hell. After the war, people took land out there from Japan. They took land in Nippon. But you don't know what Japan means? And you don't know what Hawaii is? Did you know that that's peace and love and God of things, I've said? But, like, if you're trying to establish what, like, a ruling with something of it, I don't know what she said. Where's it gonna go? A lot of places that are good. I don't know what you mean. Well, I'm gonna tell you my war plans. And more like psychically see where they're gonna go and take over so you can fuck with people. I don't think that's a good idea. But they've said, the planet is already covered. I have to assume that you're talking about biosphere. Like it's a round object in space. Shit, I'll do some fucking reading because I don't know what the fuck you're looking at. It's the dumbest fucking world ever to ever fucking believe that could possibly be any fucking cause of fucking life. Study a fucking ecosystem and then tell me what the fuck you think you were fucking doing telling me that in the fucking sky we run out of fucking air. He was your father. Um, listen. Every day. I don't know who the... Where you even found out about me from? But I'm gonna assume that question wasn't to be a jerk. My dad, I've said... I can... I've said... Um, I was... Uh, before, um, I do. Someone rescued me from hell worse than you ever know. I just, but um, he found out there was a baby down in a fucking deeper, fucking scarred, fucking hell, fucking hell planet of it. So he went and got there and came in to find me. But like, you don't know how to, how to find people when you live in, you know, jungle, I guess. But there's other, you know, the 80s. So I don't know what you guys started out on. But I've said, um, he one came and got me that there's just a person out there who's a doctor who's practicing medicine, and he came out and rescued me. Um, and but he we wondered of blood, and that's my dad. That's Carl McKilla. He's really really good, and he's super young looking for more of those. But that's a normal life that someone had to tell you that you're gonna die, and stop existing, and then you like adapted that and made everybody sad around you. Okay, retard. But look at, listen, a lot of the kids want the retards and they just call the herd a lot. Instead of you. But I'll say, I don't know, someone said the mean of it. Because I don't know how the fuck you don't know who my dad is. And then, um, Lazarus and Piper Hallowell invented me. That I was, a, that I'm a baby. So that's my biological dad. Who's a Shiva. That's fine. That's dad. But I'll say, that there's all father by blood. And so what does happen? Everybody, that's father by blood is red. And then there's a father by biology, which is green. And that's Christmas every hour. So they say, of love it. They're like, you don't know who my dad is. No, this is who invented me. He loves Michael Michael more than you could possibly ever fucking understand, imagine. But that's just his life of it. That, that you think of, got a, you got a concept for it. And you can't fucking fathom how, what that fucking means to that person. And then my godfather is, um, um, my, um, cousin's dad. 
Um, that's about that, but that's Mufasa. You guys don't know who Mufasa is. And then, then, um, then my stepfather is Liam Neeson. He's married to my mom, but he doesn't know anything about that guy's life. Is your mother really psychic? How can you be sure? Um, how can I be sure if my mom is psychic? What? I don't. What? What is psychic? You said. Let me have the sound of it. In the sound of context, will do it, guys. I don't the fuck that. Is your mother really psychic? How can you be sure? Is your mother really a god of something? Do you know what we say about her? Is that what you said? Psychic is... Right, I don't know what you said. Um, this is Honokrama Killip. You can go to honokramakillip.com slash Star Wars. And there's the... A story that I was writing. That I was... I had published online. That is still exactly where it is. That... Is the entire, like a fucking super complete copyright to Ray and the entire premise for The Force Awakens published before Disney had anything. So that's my copyright to Star Wars. I'm either a kid who got it stolen from him or I'm a Jedi. But I fought them trying to kick my butt them anyway. So I heard that, that, that I'm a Jedi. And it doesn't matter, because I got the copyright of it, because I'm the one who wrote the fucking story, and they keep doing evil things, they're mafia. So I don't know what you think being psychic looks like. What is the last ditch effort to save the human race supposed to be? Um... What's the last ditch effort to save the human race supposed to be? This is a fucking god the fucking shit. You're still on this stupid ass fucking dumb fucking ass fucking sphere space marble in a fucking vacuum of nothingness thing. The planet's not round. Fuck off. If you could have any one superpower, what would it be King Simba? That's good of what? I have a Benny? Sad? Um, I'm gonna learn a lot of the powers if I can fly, but how come everybody believes that? Um, fucking, I, I, would, I would have to say everyone, anyone's superpower? Well, everybody's like, what if you can't even fly fast? Okay, but you can't even use a jetpack if you don't, if you can't fly. That's what jetpacks are for, is people who can fly and not as fast as they want to go. But I want to be able to fly. What happens? I can fucking rise in the fucking high distance of height. But I don't believe in involuntary body function. That's a stupid fucking world. Fucking keep to your fucking self or kill yourself, you fucking heck. Where the fuck do you get that I fucking want, didn't want to enjoy my fucking life? I'm a fucking super elite martial artist. What the fuck do you think you're doing? Quit fucking talking to people like me. That's not fair in the slightest fucking regard that you bring your fucking hell and shit to me, you fucking shit lord. So the rest of the world, that's just the guy who's talking shit. Don't worry, everybody. Um, I want to fly, because then I would have every power. If you had three wishes from a genie, what are you wishing for? If I had three wishes from a genie, what do I wish for? Uh... Sad. If I said, oh, there's a genie in the lamp and I have it. Well, they said, what kind of genie am I looking at? But they said, I guess I gotta imagine it. What a wing, what a wing, what a wing. Everybody said, what is going on if I said? And then there's a genie. Then I could know that I would have to think that what you said you are is where you think that you could know that you were sure about the world that I was wishing once before that this was good and love but I could wish that who I was was good and what was real but what you think that I have still already wants to know was I can paint a crystal stone I think you'd like to know 
if what I would think that I could be was true and sure about but I need a green lightsaber with a switch and power cell on it I wish you'd simply believe me okay so that's just have uh, that whatever I said I got the lightsaber everybody knows about that okay now everybody's got that why didn't I wish for my yellow lightsaber because the switch is on the inside and that's a fucking trippy situation I can get that don't worry I've second wishes winch I've said because if you want to hang out after this that'd be cool because I know how to wish really fast and I don't know why you think I don't want to walk around off three wish happy sad so where does everybody gonna know and where do we even come from if I said of what I was gonna be and what I was gonna be in love with every day I was gonna say that everything I was gonna say is true so when I said that what I think I know about and where I want to be able to believe in is that I wish to see the Dalmatian lines of truth Now he's not gonna cancel my first wish, I said a lightsaber. He can't do it, I already know it's bullshit. I don't wanna know what the shit of the women kung fu. Everybody knows. <laughs> so the other say of them and wish for power of God and said. And then I was gonna say that I have to see that those powers and I gotta use my powers of life of good. Will this happen to everybody? Will this happen to everybody right away? And I would say, of good, of grace. I'm already wearing a, a, a Green Lantern ring, you guys don't know about that. And I would say, I would wish for my Green Lantern ring to light so I could fly. That's activating an artifact that is actually real and working. That's it. But he can't take control over a gemstone that I have. It's, the ion code of it has got the will of its own. That's the that's code for ring. It's O, your fucking ring itself. Uh, w is your hands out to put it on. And then N, like a lowercase N, is like you show your hand and you got the ring on. That's N. That's the only word for rings. I've said. Do you have another question? Oh, yeah, well, there's one more. How long is a lion supposed to live for? Are you one? I heard 3 to 17 years, Simba. What the fuck? How long is the lion supposed to live for? Jesus fucking Christ. Where the fuck do you go from lions? I don't know where you live, fucker. I don't know what you say. I don't know what you do. I don't know what you think about. I don't know what you try. I don't know what you're around. I don't know why you're talking. I don't know what you think you wanted to try and be. I don't know what you think you were going to do. I don't know why you think this is a conversation. It doesn't fucking matter. It doesn't have to be real. I don't know what you fucking think is going on. Where the fuck are you talking about? You, they said that a lion matures in three to five years. That is the length of time you are sure human hair growth is working out for the fucking man. So what the fuck are you smoking? What do you say to the end effect of a planet in time? What do you say to the end effect of a... Well, like a joke? What the fuck are you saying? What do you say to a... Okay, what do you say to... End the fact of a planet in time? I don't know why you're doing that. If you said that to me, like we're face to face, what do you say to the end effect of a planet in time? I don't think I have to speak to the planet. Do you build questions without the need for communication? Because I'm not going to join your cult. Um, do you know what time is? Time is music is space. It's music. You're going to have to look at what is creation. The ability to create music. And you, okay, so study music. And you're going to have to understand that, like, human souls create time. So I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> 